What kind of tone did it set? We saw early, of course, Tristan on KD out of the gate, LeBron on Draymond, and the trickle down effect that had. Well, it's it. There, we're gonna try and you know do different things. You know what they try and do on Bron is keep fresh bodies on him. Uh, you wear out, you wear out Bron because he has to do so much with rebounding, defense, facilitate. So to do that and to have him guard KD is tough. So uh, primarily when I was in the game, my job is just to track him and try and make his job more difficult. Try and stay moving in, in, in case they mess up on some things. Uh, but no, it, it, Tristan tonight, you know, he was so impressive. Everybody, Darren, you know, you know, hit some shots and as a true professional, regardless of how your previous games go, to show up and, and, and still keep fighting says a lot about him. Then I'm, I was happy for him. Kyle hit some big shots down the stretch. Just, if you're going to win a championship, if you're going to win finals games, everyone is going to have to play and contribute. There, there is no night off. There isn't, oh, we got next. It's like, no, this is it. And, and guys showed that tonight. Speaking of your game, Jim Jones raved about it on the radio side. I heard Mark Jackson on the TV side. At your age at this point, what does it take on this stage to impact the way you have? I Honestly, I love this game so much. It's done so much for me and my family, and I've been blessed. And I'm at a point now in my career where all that is asked of me is to compete. And if competing and whatever job it is, when I was young and I'd get mad if I didn't have 20 points in a game or I'd get mad if you know I wasn't playing 40 minutes. And now it's just Richard show up and compete, uh, bring that extra gear. And for all the guys that did that when I was you know a main scorer, um, I have no problem stepping up into the plate. And truth be told, I told every one of my teammates I love them because I don't know how many more games I have left. And I only do this because I care about each guy in this locker room. It's not about personal glory. It's about doing it for the guy next to you. How much does it help knowing that you've been to this position before, being one three down? Ah, uh, well, it doesn't help too much, honestly. Uh, it, it, you know what? We, we have people have questioned whether or not we believed we could come back when we were down 2-0. They were like, oh, well, this is different. People had doubt whether or not you know we could even win a game tonight. And the narrative has always changed. It's always bounced around. But we believe in ourselves. And that's something, you know, the mind of an athlete is very singular. It's very focused. And, and we believe that we hadn't played great basketball. And a lot of that is uh, uh, because of them and what they do. Uh, but we also believe that we have more fight. You know, we dominated this game from start to finish. Uh, there is no point in time where you know, the, the game wasn't under our control. And they have great players and a great coaching staff and we still showed that we can dominate them from start to finish this wasn't some crazy miraculous performance it was just everybody competing and contributing for 48 minutes and it, it's like I said I, I've been really disappointed and as a group our team the way we played the first three games and tonight you know it started us you know back on the right track what will game five in their building require from you guys the same effort that we had tonight. Uh, we don't. We, we just need guys to just show up and compete. If you get two minutes, if you get ten minutes, um, we, we just need guys to show up and compete. Uh, there's going to be a million sub stories on the internet about who said this, what guys were talking about. Oh, we get to win it in our building. But there's going to be all these stories. At the end of the day, we have to just win one more game. And you know, in this locker room, there's a lot of guys that have accomplished something that's never been accomplished in NBA history. So to put us in that position again, um, I think they probably have a newfound respect for what we are capable of doing. Not saying that they disrespected us, but I think uh, they're going to be more locked in and, and we have to be too.